Back in high school, my friends and I would host an annual holiday potluck. But it's been about two years since then, so I'm thinking, for old time's sake, we should host another one. This is Barbara. I've known her since junior high, when she had her identity crisis. Barbara! I'm loving the new look with um well, with the hair and everything. Thanks, but Barbara? No, it's BB now. This is Carl. I met him at a high school party. He was my go-to guy for all the brain dead and crazy things that I, myself, wanted to get into. <coughs> What's up, bro? What's up, Carl? This is Mike. He's always wanted to be the leader of our friend group, but what he has failed to realize is that I will always and continue to be the leader of our friend group. Michael? Yeah, I am. Nice button up. Is that Ralph Lauren? I believe it is. Of course. This is Nancy, and she's a hoe. No, seriously. She grew up on a farm, and she has her own garden. Nancy! Hey. How's that hoe life going for you? Oh, you know, not too well. It's getting really cold out. I'm gonna cross mm. the dice soon. Oh, bummer. Last, but of course not least, this is Marilyn. She's my ex. William, how are you? It's been so long. Marilyn. <laughs> Who do we have here? My fiance, Roger. Is there a problem? I just didn't know we were bringing extra guests to our friend's potluck. Mm. Welcome. And these are my dear friends. <laughs> I'm so happy you were able to find a chair. I wasn't expecting any more guests to come to our friend's potluck. Thank you so much for coming. I'm so happy to see you all again. Thanks so much for having us. You know, it's obviously been way too long since I last saw you guys. I, I don't know you. Um, you know, I missed you guys. Yeah, totally. It's been like, Two years since I've seen all of you? Well, not you. Roger. So, we met back in high school senior year. William had this study group. And um, I just so happened to be invited by one of William's friends, Mike. And we just kind of clicked, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, and you know, she was also dating William at the time, so that was kind of awkward, right? <laughs> I have a small question for everyone. It may be a bit random, but <laughs> this is a potluck, correct? Well, yeah. Wait. That's why we're all pot? No. It's a potluck. <sighs> but each and every one of these dishes was prepared and made and cooked by me. 
So therefore, you're welcome. So originally, we were supposed to hold this potluck at my house, but no. Once again, William has to steal my thunder. Dig in. Oh, no, no, I won't be having any of this. I'm vegan. No one asked you, Nancy. <sighs> Guys are all monsters. You can call me a monster, but this food slaps. So, is anybody doing anything for the holidays? I was gonna go to my grandma's house in Delaware. She makes a mean meal. I was spinning with you. <laughs> mm, um, Barbara, I mean, um, BB, did you have any plans next month maybe for Christmas? Um, I'm going to my cousin's funeral. What happened? Well, nothing. Yet. Conversation's a bit dry. So is this chicken. I, I'm, I'm sorry. Did you say I needed some more gravy? If so, it's right there. So, how's that communications internship going for you? Have you actually found a job that pays you actual money? Yeah, I have. But I've decided to take a break for right now. I need to let my creativity surface first. That is totally rad. I spent a whole year just finding myself. Welcome to the journey of life. Yeah, I totally understand that. It took me so long to find my true self. I went through so many bad phases. <laughs> right. Is that a pumpkin pie smell? Oh my gosh, is it vegan? Yes, indeed it is. I think that's the timer going off. You know, I come to your potluck to enjoy a free meal, but this would have never happened at my house. So now we're calling this a potluck, yet none of you brought any dishes to the potluck. Okay, I'm sorry for not showing my dearest manners to my worthless, oh, oh, oh awesome high school friends. Worthless? I'm sorry. Last time I checked, you were the one dumb enough to hook up with that floozy. I'm sorry. And then someone decided to invite Roger to our friend's study group. Leave hey. Roger out of this. You're right. You're right. Why don't you all just get up and leave? I can't do this anymore. You can't do anything, William. That's why I left you in the first place. Let's go, Roger. Well, at least the, um, the less was tender. That was eventful. Like I said earlier, this pollock should have been at my house. <sighs> Thank you.
Well, look who decided to come back. now.